Hey, good evening. Uh, Dan Fitzpatrick here, StockMarketMentor.com. First of all, members, uh, we're going to be trading the open tomorrow live in a webinar format. Um, you'll get the link to that webinar if you don't already have it. Um, Gary will send it to you. The goal in those sessions is uh, certainly I, I want to be teaching some things, but uh, I'm really trying to make you some money. That's really what the deal is uh, in these live trading sessions. First thing in the morning is we're looking for stocks that are moving um, that we can trade together right now and get uh, get you some uh, you know some stuff in the win column. So um, definitely check that out. And by the way, if you're not a member, um, go ahead and sign up for a free trial, and you can show up there too. Okay, Pinterest. Now, um, over the last several days, I think I even really started last week, I was looking at um, Beyond and I mentioned yesterday, last night, that I was out of the stock. And um, so sure enough, I got out a little bit early, but this was the best trade I've had in a while. Really, really solid moves in the stock and in the call options that I had. Um, and so would it, it would have been nice to have still been long into this morning and of course top ticked it right at 135. Um, didn't do that. What I tried to do earlier today was short the stock, but I couldn't find any, there were no shares available to borrow. So the take home on that is that this is a very, very heavily shorted stock and that is, as I suspected, the reason why one of the reasons why the stock is up so much. But at some point, you have to say, thank you very much, sir. May I have another? And then you move on. And so that's what I've done with Beyond. Um, and my my latest uh, vehicle here is Pinterest. Same kind of pattern. Um, the stock doesn't have that kind of short interest, but the pattern is still the same. So I'll trade it. Um, it's up already on three times average volume. Um, the stock's trading up, um, you know, still well off the lows, off the highs as well, though. But what I think you want to do is, uh, if you happen to be looking at this video during the afternoon here, you probably be able to get it before the close. Um, I wouldn't be buying this stock today. You got to wait to see how it works out tomorrow. Frankly, if the stock breaks out to a new high that's above 2217, then it's a pure momentum trade. Pure momentum trade, it might be a day trade. You're in the stock and then you ride it until it bucks you off. If, on the other hand, the stock pulls back a bit more, you want to see how it acts around 20, 20, 25. See if there are still buyers there at this level. I suspect there will be, and that would be kind of a safer a safer entry that won't drive you nuts. Um, so anyway, that's how I would be trading Pinterest. If you traded Beyond Meat, uh, according to my posts, you should be you should have a lot of money. You should have made this should have been a really really good trade for you. So um, and I hope you're one of those people. I hope that worked out. Um, so that's it for today, members. Um, I'll see you tomorrow morning at 9:15.